Hey, welcome to another show. Today on the show, this is the product review show, and today we have a special product. Um, I have been raising bugs for quite a few years. I know it sounds kind of crazy, but I've been raising like Madagascar cockroaches, uh, desert beetles, and um, by no means am I an expert on this. I just love the hobby and I love aquarium setup. I think it's a great learning environment in the classroom and at home. And you, you love the uh, the bugs too, don't you? Yeah, we even put spiders with them. Yep, we even have some spiders. And um, my main two uh, company guy is um, Bugs in Cyberspace. I'll have a link down below where you can find this. They have the most amazing, cool bugs and critters that you can get for your um, aquarium or your setup. And I just ordered um, a lot of things and it's in this package right here. Yeah, let's go so open it. We are going to tell you all about it and show you our new collection. Stay, Stay tuned. tuned. All right, welcome back to the show. I am so excited. Now we live in Minnesota and this is November and he put a heat pack on here. So that's what this is to keep this nice and warm. He has everything so sealed nice. And look at this, he has um, the bugs labeled. So this one is a Domino uh, Roach. This one is, these, he, he names them trogs, but they are some desert beetles. And here is three wide horn Madagascar, no, not Madagascar, three wide horn hissers. They're like gigantic cockroaches when they grow. They're just big. These are um, goblin beetles. Now you are seeing like the babies or the, the nymphs that some of them call and um, the, and they'll grow bigger. Now, this is a really cool cockroach right here. This is extinct in the wild cockroach, and there are no more. There used to be in a cave, and, and I'm not even gonna tell you the history on it, but go to his website, take a look at the YouTube video. Um, he, he goes into so much detail about this cockroach right here, but they no longer, um, are alive in the wild. It's only collectors like ourselves that are keeping them um, going. This is a Orthoporus or something like this. Oh, you can see it already. Um, this is a, um, a millipede. Uh, oh, this one's going up. Yeah. This one, this it's one. kind of like a desert type of millipede. These are warts. Um, oh, this is a... Um, this cockroach right here, this will get bigger. Like, like it'll, it'll get really big. And in the wild, it has like two spots on the back and they glow in the dark. But um, in captivity, I guess they, um, they, they don't glow, but they're, you know, you can see the spots really well. This is like Christmas time. Hey, what we are gonna do right now is um, I'm going to be putting these into my aquarium and um, I have a, a cool like desert type of aquarium set up with half of the sand and half of some coconut fiber. And so we're gonna let these guys go in there. I already have some desert beetles in there. Yeah, And what lot. else do we have? We have some crickets in there too, yep. right? And spiders. Like, and, yeah, I think we have a dandy long leg walking around in there too. So, mm. and we're gonna be letting these go in their new home. So um, why don't you join us? All right. Let's do it. Okay, here is my setup right now, and you can see that I have some sand right here. I have a little bit of a water container with some sponges, and uh, right now I have a um, beetle. Uh, right yeah, a desert beetle. I have dog food right there, and um, over here on this side, I have a. Um, let me see here. On this side. It's kind of a coconut fiber, so the bugs will be crawling around in that, and they can go on the sandy side too. So let's go ahead. And to let's go ahead and open that up. And for right now, we're just going to let the tissue in there that he has, and then later on, I think the bugs will crawl out of that. All right, we'll come back in a little bit and show you um, after we take out the tissue and let them. 
that get adjusted to their new home. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show right now. I will have a link down below where you can find all these cool insects. The name is Bugs in Cyberspace. Um, it's an awesome company. You got to check it out. These are great for your classroom or for home. And especially right now during the pandemic, when you're kind of like locked in a home, this is the perfect type of pet that you can uh, have to learn from. So um, I highly recommend it. I've been uh, raising these type of bugs. I don't know if you call it raising, um, but oh, the cockroaches, yeah. But just enjoying enjoying these type of bugs for, I would say, what was it, five years now that's going on. And it's we've just been having um, such a fun time. We've been happier than a dog with two tails. Hey, um, thanks a lot for joining our show. Please like and subscribe. It would really help us out. And stay tuned to our other shows. All right, we'll talk to you later. Adios. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. Adios. See this bug? Bye.